Okay. The only thing I skipped was my character creation. That's all I did. We just loaded in. I don't know where it had loaded me from. Don't know where I'm at. Don't know what I'm doing. But this game looked effing adorable. So Panda decided to play it. Oh my god, I love her socks. I want sparkly socks. So as far as I know, I'm a reporter in this one too. And there's a bunch of kitties. Or at least from what the thingy said. So we will see what happens. I will do my best to read everything to you. Uh, I guess this game doesn't talk. And I was really, really hoping that I wouldn't have to talk. But it's fine. It's fine. So this game is called Calico. Yep. Mountain right there. So we'll update that. And we will go for it. Fingers crossed we like this game. Because we finished Bug Snacks. Beat it yesterday. Ugh. Alright, let's go. Oh my gosh, uh, hello! I think her name is Kiva. Welcome to Heart Village. I'm Kiva, the mayor of this little village. We are so excited to have you here. We were all so sad to have your aunt retire and the cafe shut down. Honestly, the village just isn't the same without her. Though she did send me a postcard last week and it looks like she's really enjoying traveling. Apparently there are cats on other islands. Isn't that amazing? Well, of course there's going to be cats on other islands. Okay. Shush, panda. <laughs> Oh, whoops. Of course, you'd know all about that, having come from another island. <laughs> it's like she heard me. <laughs> Anywho. All that matters is you are here now. First things first. Why don't you look inside your new cafe? It's a little boring and empty right now, but that's up to you to fix. Maybe I'm not a journalist in this one. Maybe I'm messing up my games. Why don't you go inside and check the place out? Come back and talk to me when you're done. Oh geez, wait. Even more first. I need to give you your welcome gift. Here's a couple things that will help you settle in. Okay, she gave me $500 and something else? It's Monday. Should I talk to her again? Hey, friendo. Did you check out the place? I love the layout and that star-shaped sign is so pretty. There's a lot of work to do. It's completely empty um, of both people, animals, and food. I actually brought you some furniture to help out, but I embarrassingly didn't know which kind you would like best, so I ended up bringing a whole bunch. What would you say your style is? A uh, spooky? Oh, perfect. I made these items of that type. You should place them in the cafe when you get time. Oh, I am so excited. She let me pick spooky? Use toy. Hold the pet. Furniture. Uh, what is this? Scratching post? I don't know what to do. Whatever comes our way, rain or shine. Thank you. 
That is not how that works. Upstairs. Now this is all okay. Inventory spooky. Okay, wallpaper. <sighs> well, I like the paw prints because there's like nothing else for me to do. Oh. What does it do? color background What does this one mean? I mean, those don't look like normal colors, but that's fine. Okay. Guess that's it. Got all this. It's upstairs. And it's my bedroom. What do I gotta do? It's back here. Do I touch it? Can't touch it? Animals. I don't have any. Okay. How the F am I supposed to run a cat cafe with no pets?
Okay. Hmm, okay, what's next? Animals! Your aunt always had a bunch of cute, cuddly animals in her cafe. Honestly, it is the best part of the whole thing. Why don't you look around and adopt an animal for the cafe? Normally, you should just avoid wild animals, but the magic of this island has made them all super friendly and cuddly. You can pick up any animal and use the animal command to tell them to follow you or to go to the cafe. Your animal journal keeps track of all the animals you've met and lets give you these them and lets you give them names, summon them to your party and give them hats. Okay. Did it seriously go into the cafe? Where'd it go? Kitty! Pick up the calico. Animal command. Oh, that's cute. Follow me! Kitty, kitty. Oh my god, that's so cute. Okay. Pick up the calico. Hold the wiggle the animal. What does that mean? How do I put you down? <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> <laughs> oh, what should I name it? <laughs> what should I name it, Gavin? Doesn't tell me what it is. Gavin, what should I name it? I don't got no hats. That's what the kitty looks like, Gavin. What should I name it? Name the kitty, Gavin. I don't know if that's gonna fit, but we'll try. That's a very generic name. Just so you know. Alright, kitty, you're coming with me. <laughs> what was the last thing? I can't seem to recall. Oh, food! Duh. Okay, so the other thing you need to learn is making food for the cafe. Can't have a cafe without cafe drinks or food your aunt left you a couple recipes but it's not many i'm sure if you talk to other villagers they may be able to share some family recipes with you in exchange for your help but for now why don't you head into the kitchen and try out one of those recipes oh Something else to note, this island is very much based in old magic. The way we do things is a bit different here. I think you'll really enjoy the cooking though. It's pretty fun to throw an egg the size of your whole body. What? Oh, you'll see. Go try it out. Uh, okay... Make food. Oh my god, I'm making cookies! What? What is happening? 
Collect the ingredients and toss it into the cauldron. Flour, sugar, egg, butter, milk. Where is everything? Um. Uh. <sighs> okay. Flower. Do I seriously have to do this one at a time? Oh my god. Yeah, I did. Okay. Whoa! I fell in! Okay, I don't die. This. Oh! Hi, sugar. <sighs> what the F? Okay. How the F do I get to the fridge? I bet there was a secret passage. No? Okay. Sure, I'll just I'll just I'll just run over to the fridge. Because this makes sense. Using spoons to launch myself across the kitchen. <sighs> Do I, I use the whole stick of butter? How do I throw the butter? Oh, okay. That makes sense. This is so ridiculous! Mix it? What is this game?
literally this bug snacks is normal compared to this game. Pasta cookies. Oh, Jesus. Gavin, what did I get myself into? Gavin, why weren't you here when I was picking out games? Gavin! <laughs> Why did you let me do this, Gavin? Toss the pan into the... How am I supposed to toss the pan... Oh my god. Okay. <sighs> I think I just burnt my cookies. Totally fucked up my cookies. And Resident Evil 4 is tomorrow, Gavin! Oh, I'm so proud of you! You're a natural! I guess all that's left is meeting some of your neighbors. Once you've met someone, they will start coming to the cafe whenever they have free time in their schedule. When people visit your cafe, they'll buy the food you've made, even when you aren't there. Your magical food stock is infinite! So, don't worry about making new food every day. However, the town folk all have different tastes, so if you change up the food in your display case, you may... They may tip you more for their favorites. Unfortunately, we have had some problems traveling to and from other areas of the island, which sucks. I haven't been able to get to the hot springs for months. Maybe one of the villagers has an idea of how to fix some of the blockades. Anyway, I hope you get the cafe back up and running. If you ever want to chat with me about it, you can find me or anyone else you've met on your map. See ya, friendo. Um. Hello, friendo. How are you doing today? Need anything? We should really get the path to the mountains opened up so everyone in town can visit their friends. Okay. How do I put the cat down? <laughs> Animals, you. Inventory? Can I put you down? <laughs> what? What do I do? <laughs> How do I put you down? Mm. 
You're the only animal I have. Get off of my head, please. Ugh. You know, I'm trying to leave the cat. Uh. Kitty, <laughs> off my head. Do. Oh, thank God. Okay. We got the cat off my head. Doesn't have a map for me. So we will just run, run around, I guess. Don't know where to go. <sighs> I did walk over water. Doesn't make any sense. Kitty? Pick up kitty! You gonna go? You probably don't know the cafe. Follow me? Kitty? Kitty? Had to go super slow for you.
I don't want to put it on my head again. It'll get stuck. What am I naming this one? Yellow something. Really? These cats are gonna have terrible names! You're terrible. <sighs> you hurt my heart. You know that? terrible. Yeah, I only have four cookies left. Had to be careful. Just leave that there. Fuck it.
It really is a very girly game. I love it. And are you saying I'm a girl? Are you saying I'm girly? Because I think this is adorable. I'd get, get it from uh, the game pass area. Are you trying to look it up for me so you can be helpful? up these cookies too. This is ridiculous. I knew you would. I'll be there till the end. It's the nerd in me. Puppy? What? Puppy? It's literally just an animal cafe. Oh my god, I am so excited. What are we naming the puppy? Oh my god, I love it! What are 
are we naming it? What are we naming the Australian Shepherd? Okay, finally a name. Okay. I don't even know where the town is. Okay, so it must be an Xbox exclusive. I'm sorry. Hello there, my name is Maya. Vice President of the Owl Club at your service. Oh, but I'm sorry, the Vice President of nothing right now. There was a landslide that blocked the path into the mountains. If we can't go to the mountains, that means we can't go to the Owl Club headquarters. And if we can't go to the Owl Club headquarters, that means we you can't meet Freya. She's the president of the Owl Club and the president of my heart. I'm in a real pickle of beans right now is what I'm saying. Oh no, what's wrong? I don't know if Kiva mention this to you, but there is a landslide at the entrance of Snowbell Mountains. It's such a bummer. Can I help? Oh my gosh, that would be amazing! I have no idea how you can help, but if you find a way through, I promise you can be a prestigious member of our Owl Club. I've asked everyone in town to help, but no one could, except for Autumn. I haven't asked her yet. She lives in the bottom in the bottle on top of the hill next to your cafe. It's really, really high up and I'm scared of heights. I know that seems weird for an owl-based magical girl, but I actually can't fly. Okay. Find someone named Autumn in a bottle near my cafe. Because that's helpful. Oh my god, it's a crow! Let me touch you! Can I pet you? Oh my god, I can pet you! Oh my god, I'm just gonna run with you. Oh my god, I am so excited. Ah, <laughs> they named it Poe. Hmm. 
I know what I'll do. Hey, brother, question. What's up? So, I'm streaming on Twitch. It's a game of an animal cafe. I just caught a crow. Name it. Uh, uh, a crow, you said? Yeah, it's all black. Uh, birdie. Oh, my God. <laughs> Everybody and their generic names. Well, Gavin, my one of my followers, he named our yellow cat. It it, it was a tiger cat. He named it Yellow Something. Oh my God. He named our calico <laughs> Crazy Cat Woman. And he named our Australian Shepherd that I found Oreo. So hmm. y'all are being basic. <laughs> well, I was trying to remember uh, the actual name of the character for, from the crow. Like his actual name. Oh. The crow. I don't know that. Well, let me know. But I his called was, because it was faster. <laughs> his name was Jason Lee, the actor, but I don't know his name either. Yeah, I don't remember his <laughs> name either. And now Gavin's laughing at me. He's like, what's this? Phone a friend? you damn right it's phone a friend. And it's te technically phone my brother, mister. <laughs> now, um, yeah, I don't know. Well, I named it Birdie. You said Birdie. I named Birdie. it Birdie. <laughs> Birdie. <laughs> <laughs> All right, brother. I love you. I may call you with another random ass because Gavin sucks. <laughs> oh my god. Alright. Alright, love you. I love you too. Alright, bye. Bye. Alright, brother named it Birdie. Ugh. Y'all are killing me. You're killing me. Okay. I keep clicking the stick to run. And it's just hiding everything. Oh no. I lost <laughs> where her house was. Okay. There's my house. Okay, she's over here. Do, 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 do. She's probably not even going to be at home. Ooh, I love her house. How do I talk to you? There you go. No one's buying your cookies. Your money hasn't increased. I know. Greetings, traveler, and welcome to my... Palatial... Emporium of potent, potable, potable, <laughs> portable, <laughs> portable potions. I'm potent. Autumn. I'm Autumn. So, sorry. I don't have any potions right now. My cat Char is missing and I have no idea where she is. And the worry has gotten me totally behind on making potions. I could help look for your cat. Wow, that would be incredible. I have a feeling she might be near the center of town. Last time she went missing, I found her in a pile of clothing at the clothing store. She wasn't there when I checked earlier, but it's probably a good place to start. Uh, joke's on you. The town is probably closed. Another crow! <laughs> 
All right, well, hold on. What? Its name is Inkwell? <laughs> no, it was not another phone call. It was me having to pee. Must be the new cafe owner. Kiva offered to let me take care of the cafe, but it turns out cats are very different from flowers. They both require a lot of love, but cats don't like getting watered. Oh my, name's Blossom, by the way. It's nice to meet you. If you ever want to plant your roots and soak up some sun, you can visit the garden Sunny and I share up the hill. Cool. Hi, I'm Sunny. Blossom and I are so excited about the Cat Cafe reopening. It's where we first met. I thought about running the cafe myself, but that would have spoiled the magic for me. Besides, I'd rather run the Boardwalk Arcade. You think if I get the high score on every machine, I legally own the place? Oh, okay. What's over there? Oh my god, is that a chicken? <laughs> oh 
All right. You both are coming with me. You're both coming home with Panda. You there, you look like a person that appreciates a good flower and we appreciate people that appreciate good flowers because good flowers is what we got. Uh, I don't get to practice my sales pitch to new people very often, but you get the idea. I'm Lily. I hope my pops runs the flower store. I help my pops run the flower store. Okay. Well, now look who it is. It's been so long since I've seen you. Why, you've grown up from a sprout to a sunflower. We've never met before, have we? Oh, thank goodness. I thought I had just forgotten. My name is Poppy. I run the flower shop along with my daughter, Lily. You can have... You can never have too many flowers. Okay. Kitty! Um. Pick up. Go to the cafe! Okay, y'all are coming with me. We're going to the cafe, even though I'm lost. Mm. I lost the chicken too. I want a black cat. How did I get the animal off of my head? <laughs> it's a chicken! <laughs> oh my god, I am so excited! <laughs> I touch you. How do I get it off of my head? Um, it's patches, patches. <laughs> I already have eight animals. See, you say RB. But... It's trying to make me pick up my crows and shit. It's a lie, Gavin!
don't know if he's at work or not. Let's find out. Austin! Hello? Am I bothering you? Who is this? It's Kirsty. Kirsty? What the hell? Why do you have a different number? Oh, I have a different number. Okay. Oh. I don't have this number. Okay. <laughs> it says weird some random Arizona number was calling me. Uh. Well, I was very scared that it wasn't you. <laughs> Sorry. So, question. I am streaming on Twitch. I need you to name this black and white cat that I have tamed for my cafe. I think it's called Calico. It's an Xbox exclusive. It's on Game Pass for free. But... Yeah, I've never played it. Me either. Until today. And I'm going through and calling people off my contacts. You are the second person I have called to name one of these animals. Alright, uh, well, name him Panda. Or her. But my character's name is Panda, so I can't. How do you spell it? W H I S. Okay. The black and white cat name is Weiss. There you go. I may call you later. I apologize that you did not have this number saved. <laughs> yeah, no, you're good now that I know. And thank you for answering. Yeah. <laughs> that would have been a very awkward voicemail. And you would have been like, uh, I don't, I don't know that person. Yeah. Okay, well, yeah, this is my phone number, and I will talk to you later. Okay, I'll be here. <laughs> okay. bye. Oh, this is so fun. It's like a Russian roulette. <laughs> How do I get it off of my head? Okay. I was sitting down. And he told me to do something. How did we get it off of my head? Oh, this is so frustrating. How did we get it off of my head? Oh, it's B! I figured it out. It's B. Okay. Alright. Uh. <laughs> okay. Okay, alright. Uh. That's right. You roam around, cat. Oh no, I'm in the water! Oh, I jump like Spider-Man. Okay. Find Autumn's cat Char. Something about being in town.
Well, that kind of looks like a town. What's this? Can I go in here? Nope, can't go in there. Okay. Who are you? Oh my gosh, are you the new cat cafe owner? I've been so excited to meet you. This is the best day ever. My name is Maribel, and I own the fashion store in town. You should come by and see my clothes. You would like look amazing in them. You already look amazing. I love your outfit. But you can always have more. Okay. Definitely no cat in there. Who are you? Oh my, what do we have here? A new customer? Or should I say a new neighbor? You're the one that took over the old cat cafe, aren't you? I always admire the industrious spirit. I'm sure we'll get along famously. Please have a look at my store. You'll need to furnish that cafe if you want customers. Ooh, I'm excited. What do you have for me? Oh. What do I got? Oh. I mean, I can afford a bagel recipe. But nothing else. Hey, always cool to see a fresh face around here. I'm Ash. I, uh, work at the general store. I don't know his get her, but I've learned more magic from her than I ever did in magic school. So the job isn't the worst. And you're closed. <sighs> Who are you? Why do you look like that? Can I talk to you? Meow, 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 meow. Meow. Donut recipe, cloud carpet, Zumbo plush. Oh my god, I love him! Remote control mouse, egg coffee table. I love him. I want him. I'll come back and buy that. Kitty! Char, you're who I'm looking for! You come with me, Kit Kat. Right meow. Yeah, get it? Another crow. What is your name? Who are you? Oh, I can't tell. As I fling this cat around. <laughs> oh, I'm a terrible human being. <sighs> kitty, kitty. Whoa! Hey, yo, panda, calm down. Panda! Okay. Alright, alright. Hey. Greetings, traveler! Is this your char? I can't believe you found my char so quickly! How can I ever repair you? Repay you? Help with the landslide? Hmm. That's a hard one. It would be great to be able to go back to the mountains since one of my biggest customers is there. Lumi. Up at the snow bell, hot springs, always commissions potions from me for her herbal baths. I don't really make potions that blow up rocks though. Let me think about this. I got it, come back tomorrow and I should have something ready for you. God, please let me have the money to do such. Because I bought stuff. Let me down! Bah! 
Where's my house? Can I not see my house? I have to run all the way down this thing to see my house. Rude! I love how she sings at me. Okay. Let's make some food. Let's make some coffee. Grind beans. Oh, uh, maybe. Beans! Press the button to pour the coffee into the cup. Decorate your coffee. With what? This game is ridiculous. Gavin! <laughs> Tell me it's okay to switch games. <laughs> it's a very nice soundtrack. It's actually very quite peaceful. Gavin, you need to tell me we can switch games. Did you bring me home food? Thank you. 
I don't know. Yeah, I don't understand what's happening. I'm trying. I don't know how to control this dumb bitch. I told you, I don't know how to move this character. did that spin yes sorry bagels doesn't tell me shit. I hate this thing. Yes. 
Suck at it. <sighs> All right, y'all. Ben's going to leave right here. I'm going to pee. And we're going to stream a different game. Because this is ridiculous. I will see y'all soon. Bye!